All right, this is going to be a pizza garden. And children love pizza, and it's really fun to show them what plants all the key ingredients come from. Well, you, you keep talking about children. I love this garden, so let's. Okay, let's... that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Okay, <laughs> now to keep the you know, this this is a this is a patio tomato, which is what we call it, and, and a determinate tomato. It grows to a certain height, about 24 to 30 inches, and then starts producing its 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 fruit or the tomatoes, and then. You've got a variegated basil. Here. This is a phenomenal basil. This mm. one is called. Pesto Perpetuo. Oh, that's nice. And it's phenomenal. Yeah. And it's variegated and it tends to be more upright and spiky. So it's a real interesting plant. And then this is the Italian oregano. It's different than the Greek oregano and it really smells better and it tastes better. It has much more flavor. Mm -hmm. So look for the Italian oregano. Well, I mean, if you're going to do uh, pizza, you have you, to have Italian you have oregano. Italian. Okay. okay, so what we'll start with though is let's put this in because we want to get this in the pot to help support that tomato. And then I like to I like to put the tomato towards the back and it'll grow up and then we have the uh, oregano and the basil in the front. So do the, the trick and it's, you need to kind of work inside here and turn it upside down. And tomatoes really benefit from planting them a little bit more deeply. I'm gonna dig it just a little bit deeper, which I usually don't do, but we dig it deeper, and then we're gonna firm the soil around it. And I'm teasing these roots a little bit. We've talked about that mm -hmm. before, where, you know, they're a little tight, but you don't have to manhandle them, but That's also don't be shy. You can, you can tease these roots a little bit, and this one, we're just gonna set right on top. It's the, it's the exact right depth, okay. And then uh, the basil. And again, I'm just going to tease the roots just a little bit. That encourages the roots to grow away from the root ball out into the surrounding soil so you get a much healthier, happier root system. I'm going to put that up front a little bit away Perfect. from the tomato. In fact, because move the tomato that a little. is going to lead a lot, yeah. a lot of room. And then these guys will, and then, and then we're just going to fill the soil all the way to one inch from the top of the pot. So you have room to water. Perfect. And I'll fill this in around. This tomato is going to get as tall as this ring, maybe about five inches taller. So this will support it, and it's going to get really big in the pot. The basil and oregano will stay a little lower and kind of cascade out the front so you can pay attention to them. Now, the only plant we're missing is peperomia. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> oh, my gosh. That was a horticulturist joke, <laughs> but it was very good. And that makes me really hungry. It makes me think of Irving's for red hot lovers. Ooh, we're going to Irving's to get a dog. Yeah. A Chicago style dog.